Who's the best player in the world ever? Me. In my mind, I'm always the best. I don't care what the people are thinking, what they say. In my mind, not just this year, but always, I'm always the best. I'm always going to say that because we are, I think we have to thinking we are the best in our, our, our area. So in my area, I think I'm the best. Do you think what makes you different to the others is the dedication level that you put in? I think I'm good, but I think my main strength, it's my mind. I think uh, it's my strongest point, it's my mind. Pierce, the, the numbers they don't like. If you see during the last 15 years, my, my level is always kind of the same. So effort, dedication, work hard, because the talent is not enough anymore. And if you don't dedicate it 100%, not gonna reach the level that you want. I'm always a competitive uh, player. Uh, and not just in the games, I'm in the training, I'm like that. In the home, with my sisters, with my mom, with uh, my nephews, I'm always uh, try to competitive hard and try to win. Uh, I'm like that, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I never change. Uh, because I like, I like this, I like what I do, I like my life, I'm a happy person. When I'm 12 years old, most of the people told me, Cristiano, you are a very, very good talent player, but you are very skinny, very slim. And I put it in my mind, the body, we can improve. We can improve. You got gym, uh, dedication and hard work, you can improve. So I have improved myself. You have to work. I try to do it almost every day. This is why I'm in a top level many, many years. Because I do it extra outside the pitch. Because I'm I really like to put myself in the pressure to see what I can, can, can do. Talent is not enough, you have to. I dedicate myself so much that this is part of me. Records is part of me. I don't follow the records. The records follow me, which is different. Are you addicted to winning? Yes, I am. I'm addicted to the success. Maybe sometimes I agree. Maybe I have bad image in a pitch because I'm too serious. I take serious, but if you really know me, if you are my friend, if you live inside my house, if you share the day with me, you will know that I hate to lose. The people who call me arrogant, most of them, I like, you know, one day to sit with them and to have a, you know, a chat with them to see which way they see that I am arrogant because they I think they have to to sit with me to speak with me to know the, who is real Cristiano what's your secret because you're showing no signs of slowing down Cristiano. no secrets don't exist secrets the secret is dedication and hard work you know to be uh, able to to work 100% all the time uh, this is if exists words it's it, this is, is my secret the best players always follow the best players. They want to be uh, in the top of the, the game because they are the ones they are there. You know, you cannot rest or sleep because the other one can pass you. Of course, we fight with everyone. With uh, Neymar, with uh, Messi, with Lewandowski, with Higuain, you know, with the top of the, the best players in the world. So, I mean, this is not fighting, but it's, it's, it's hard, it's healthy. You know, comparison is healthy. And we fight, you know, to be the best. This is why it's my, my main point, it's my motivation, it's to be better than them, than them, year after year. And he said to me, Cristiano, the most important thing, I knew it, and everyone know that. And he said, Cristiano, we have money, we have everything, we have fame. And he said, I have millions, billions, but the most important thing, it's the family, keep your family, healthy, good, and take care of your family because this is the most important thing in the world. A part of that, of course, you have your life, your private life, you have your girlfriend, you have uh, your cars, your houses, your fame. But in the beginning, your family, it's always with you for the good moments and for the bad moments. But I know I depend on many people, but to be honest, I'm, if you're thinking too much about that, you lost your focus which is, is the most important. You know, my focus is to be a good man, 
and uh, to do it my my job properly. So this is what I'm trying to do. I know many people depend on me, but this is is other side of me. I I try to don't to don't focus on that because in my it's important, but for me it's not the most important. It's about the balance. Uh, we have time for everything, uh, you know, to enjoy with uh, my son, to do it properly, my job, you know, to be fit all the time, to training properly all the time, to play good, because it's my life, you know, as you know, uh, the soccer in America right. and football in Europe, you know, it's, it's, it's great and it's my passion, it's what I love to do. And to be fit all the time, to be in the top of the level, many, many years, you have to be consistent. So this is what I'm trying to do, to be, to be good, to be uh, in a good shape and uh, try to enjoy uh, the people. This is what I love to do. I have to improve and I'm, I want to improve. And I see myself to do it when I'm retired, to speak for m millions of people, advices, how to be a professional player, how to maintain your longevity, how, I'm not a psychologist, but I pass through many, many things and I can... You know, above, pass, all, above all, how to win. How to win, which is the most important. And I think it's what it's all about. I have experience to, to inspire people for that. I think I'm, I'm a role model and I, I can help many, many people in that way if they want my help. They I will listen help. to it, right? For sure. Especially the young people. I want to be with the young people, to speak with them, not only for them, but for the fathers as well, to put them in, in the right spot. I see football now as a business, to be honest. I don't understand, they treat you, they treat your players like a piece of meat. I say, yes, you say everything, it's true. When they want you, when they, 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 they count with you, they give you everything. When they don't, they try to, to make a hard life to you. I see football the last years as a business. I saw many, many things that I'm disappointing. The passion for the game is still intact, but in the same way, I say I saw other things as well, which is, is surprise me, but in the same way, uh, it's part of the business because if you see the world, uh, how it is in the moment, it's, it's all business. Everyone take on itself. Everyone, they are more individual. Listen, you have one game, after three, four days, you have to be in the national team, preparation for the World Cup. It's hard. Sometimes you have to sell everything and be with your family, take the best decisions. And in this summer, I didn't feel comfortable. I feel uncomfortable the way they treat me, especially the, um, the press, they doubt about me, the professional that I am. It's impossible to be 21 in the top of the game if you're not professional. They, they, they doubt about me, which is make me feel very, very, very sad because in my life, I'm always one of the best professionals. This is why I'm still playing the high level. I'm always say it's, it's all package. You know, first of all, it's the talent helps a lot, of course, but of course the ethic of work, uh, you have to put in your mind ethic of work when you are professional. So since day one, uh, when I start with the uh, professional, let's say, with 16, 17, 18, I'm always have an ethic to be the best, to train hard, to listen to all the players, experienced players. And um, of course, my dream coming true. I, I was professional. I played in the best clubs in the world. I won the most important trophies. So I'm glad to be in this position. But of course, this is not coming from the sky. I, I dedicate myself and I'm working hard. And this is why the goals and uh, all the achievements that I get coming from dedication and hard work. I'm always say it was uh, the uh, toughest time in my life. It was when I left my family with 11 uh, years old to live in a different world, which is Lisbon, in the same country, but it looked like it's a different part of the world. Uh, I was cry almost every day to miss my family, but. I'm not, I'm not regret uh, because it was probably the more, inten more intense moments in my life that I, that I lived through. So without sacrifice, you cannot uh, win nothing. So I did an unbelievable sacrifice, my family too. And I think it was, I think I, have, I did a good option.
it's it's stupid question when the people say, ah, they are not the same. Hey, nobody is the same. Day by day, we're getting old. Every one of us, you understand, is normal. You have to adapt. And I think nobody in this game have this brain that adapts with his age. I'm not. I'm not want to be cocky to say that I'm the same that when I was 20. Of course, no. But I'm adapt and I be smart to know my strength, what I'm good to do. And I'm still playing the high level and I score goals and I will continue to score goals if my mind is clear and happy. And if the people surround me, they are help me to be a successful player, especially the coach, the president, directives. But when you feel that the energy don't go surround you, it's difficult you to be yourself, which has happened. This is what's happened with me. When I arrive in Manchester United, I always be available to help the team to do the good things, to put in the right spots, to compete with the best teams. But it's hard when they they cut your legs and they, they don't like you to shine and they don't listen to your advices. I think I, I, I have a word to advise to the club because the trophies that I won, individual and collective, I think I can help a lot, but when the infrastructure is not good, no. they criticize me when I don't speak. Of course, when I'm going to speak, they're going to criticize me even more, but it's something that I can I can deal with that. Uh, I know I'm going to disappoint a few people. Maybe I'm going to make up a few people, but it is what it is. The life is it's completely difficult. We have obstacles in our lives and um, I will keep running to fight against the people who don't believe me. And the life is a challenge. And I want to people the people that they are wrong.